Yes, hello member. We are looking at one of the very last forms of differentiation and uh, it's called second derivative. Now, before I go to second derivative, the first derivative it's denoted by dy dx and one could also say f with an apostrophe of x this is first derivative second derivative is given by d2y dx squared and one could write it as also f with double apostrophes of x so this is second derivative also this is second derivative this is first derivative this is also first derivative oh the first differentiating this is the second differentiating now from the formula the general formula which i have in here which says that d d dx of dy dx so this one only simply means that if you go on to differentiate what you first differentiated as your first derivative you must be able to get the second derivative which is denoted or said as d2y d x squared and this one also it is the same as differentiating with respect to t i hope you are following of dy dx that if we go on to differentiate our dy dx then times dt dx we have to be able to get the second derivative because if I cancel this at the end of it all, I will remain with d2 squared y dx squared, as you see it here. But I will explain in an example, which I will give later. I hope you are following. And this one also, it is the same as d of dt of dy dx i hope you are following this time it will be divided by dx dt so in here i've used division in here i've used subtraction such that if you flip this division side the dt will go up and the x will go down so this general equation means the same and it's going to make sense after i've given a certain example in here and please follow for you to be able to use <coughs> such an expression so suppose i'm given my x as a into t squared minus one and y to be as 2a into t plus 1. And they want me to find dy dx. Also, they want me to, to find the second derivative, which is d2y dx squared. How do we go about such a question? So now I'm going to start to teach. Before we go any further, I have my x, which is that. Which means that my d... Okay, let me rearrange it very well. In here, I will have a t squared minus a. I hope you are following. So, I will have my dx dt to be 2a t. This one automatically will be zero. Remember, there is a silent t to power 
1. So if I subtract 1 as a power, as differentiation is done, it will beat it to power 0, but that 0, which was here, if it comes, it will cancel this. So this is my dx dt. I hope you are following. So getting my dx dt, still my dt, dx will be 1 over 280. Will be 1 over 280. So having done that, I have my y. If I try to open the bracket, I'll have 280 plus 2a. If I differentiate it with respect to t, I'll be able to get 2a. I believe you are following. So in here will be 0. Now I'm coming to the major stuff now. Now my dy dx is equal to dy dt times dt dx. What is my dy dt? It is 2a times hope you are following my dy dx equals to dy dt times dt dx what is my dy dt it is 2a times dt dx i already have it here it is 1 over 280 so this will cancel and my dy dx will equal to 1 over t I hope you are following my dy dx will become 1 over t and this is equal or the same as t to power negative 1 so I've finished the first requirement but all they want is the d second derivative the d2y dx squared so using the formula I'm not going to stress myself so using the formula let me begin from here d 2y dx squared which is equal to I'm using now the formula d dt of dy dx times dt dx so if i go on to differentiate my dy dx which is respect to t this one i'm going to be able to get negative 1 t i hope you are following to power negative 2. Remember when you are differentiating, you subtract 1. But after bringing that negative 1, but my, multiplying it, the power, after multiplying it, so we carry its negative sign. So it will be negative t, power negative 2. So, differentiating this, I get this. So, times dt dx. What is my dt dx? It's in here which is 1 over 280 I hope you are following so this one it is the same as negative 1 over t squared times 1 over 280 so my final answer of the 2y the x squared is equal to negative 1 over 280 to power 3. So this is my final alpha answer. Thank you very much for following. I hope you subscribe, like, comment, and we we'll see for other videos. So this is second derivative. This is how it's done. 
Thank you very much.